All right, so let's talk to this guy. I've seen you around school. You're that new transfer student, aren't you? All right, we're fighting a trainer. You're Ray the student. A Fletching. Oh, I don't think I have any good moves that are good against this, do I? I guess we'll do Ring Attack. Pretty decent. Damn, almost killed the instant member. Oh, it's got fire? I didn't know that. Fire fight. No Super Real Vibe says, What weapons have I unlocked in multiplayer of Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2? Oh, a good amount. I basically did most of the uh, cost off skill tree. So, three different cost off assault rifles, a couple of light machine guns. But currently, I'm using an FTAC battle rifle, which is a single shot that's very accurate, and I like it because of the damage output. <clears throat> okay. The new kid's really shaking things up. He's applauding. He's applauding his own ass whooping. It's interesting. Derek says some trivia. Rockwell is a Pokemon Ash gets from Pressure Kukui in the Sun and Moon anime. Has three forms a midday, a midnight, and a dust form, and evolves depending on the time. Oh, that's interesting. What the hell is that? What? Caps. Capsa Kid? Capsa Kid? I have no idea. Try Wing Attack. We insta killed it. It was super effective. Oops. Well, I don't know what that was. I'm going to find another one. Capsa Kid. Level up for Flamigo and Horn Tints also leveled up. I have to find another Capsa Kid. I didn't mean to kill it. I didn't know that was going to happen. Whoa, I don't want to go down there. Capsa Kid. It's a spicy pepper Pokemon. Is that new? I don't think I've ever seen a Capsa Kid. So is that a new Pokemon? There's one. All right. Double kick. All right. I won't kill it. Cool. I'll be able to catch it. Capsa Kid. Something like that. There we go. Catch that Capsa Kid. Get it. Nice. Let's see what this is. Capsicum spicy pepper. <laughs> Baxter is leveled up. Is going to learn a new move. <clears throat> water pulse. I don't know how good the water pulse is. I don't remember the move. Let's see. The user attacks the target with a pulsating blast of water and may confuse the target. Whoa, that's better than Aqua Jet. That's significantly better than Aqua Jet. Oh. Uh, Hmm. Do I want to get rid of work up, or do I just want to outright just replace Aqua Jet? Right? Oh, okay, Capsa Kid is brand new. Cool, I can't wait to see it. Get rid of Pound? Yeah, but I need a normal type. I need at least a normal type. Oh, that is true. There's physical and special type attacks. Ugh. I don't know what to do here. Oh, really? It's a grass fire Pokemon? All right, wait. Let me do this first. You're getting ahead of yourself. Get rid of Pine. All right, I'll just do this. I probably did the wrong thing. All right. I'm back. Baxter learned Water Pulse. Now, let's look at this Capsa Kid. Grass type. Spicy pepper Pokemon. The more sunlight the Pokemon bays in, the more spicy chemicals are produced by its body, and thus the spicier its moves will become. <laughs> That's funny. No, I don't want to give it a nickname. I screwed up. Well, there you go. Capsa Kid. Interesting that it's grass and fire type. All right, sweet. It, it, it evolves into a Scoville. Scovillain? What is a Scovillain? How dare you tell me I can't jump up something? I'll just go backwards. Screw you. Hyper potion. Oh, we are surrounded by uh, 
a slew of new Pokemon at this point, right? Like down there, that's a new one. That's a new one. Wow, we gotta catch all these. What is this thing? What the hell is that? Is that a little, oh my gosh, a little elephant. Fan pee. It's a tiny little elephant. That's cute. We gotta catch this guy. Defense Pearl. All right. Get him. Get this little elephant. Name Dumbo. No! He broke free. He's growling at me. I'm gonna try again. get it? We got it this time. Okay. Cool. Bumpy. Ground type. Long-nosed Pokemon. The Pokemon lives in a nest on a riverbank. After playing in the mud, it won't be able to settle down unless it washes its body. <laughs> That's funny. No super vibes, I don't know what you mean. Says, does each level up depend on the Pokemon themselves? I don't know what that means. <clears throat> Alright. Cute fan pee. We still haven't found a fighting type for CM4. We're trying, though. Whoa, I jumped for joy after catching the fan pee. And I landed on top of something. Oh, is this a fighting type right here? I think it is. I think this is Mankey. Yeah, I think Mankey's fighting type, actually. Alright. Let's double kick him. Oh, he's gonna die! Oh! oh no. I killed the Mankey. I kicked it so hard. Damn it. I need to find another one. Here's one. Wait! Oh, I got attacked from behind by a rock rock. Does each Pokemon level up the same way to a certain level, or are they all different? I think they all do level up to the same level, maximum level, but they all evolve differently, meaning certain ones that hit a certain level will evolve, change their appearance, change their stats, learn new abilities, and stuff like that. All right. Now, here's a Mankey. Try not to kill it. Professor Brain says probably use a different leading Pokemon. This one's too strong. You're going to kill everyone. You're right, actually, aren't you? Oh, back to back to him, or let's try Bonsley or Bonslaw. Wait a minute, I just realized something. Bonsly is weak to Mankey. His fighting type is strong against Rock type. That was really stupid. That's gonna hurt. Oh. Oh no. Ash got a fan pee on a Pokemon in his Jojo journeys and evolved into God. Oh, Mankey has three evolutions? Damn, that's good. Let's try nuzzling him. Oh my god! Why is this thing so tough? No! Oh. 
Catch that manky. Come on. Get it. Get it. Stay in there. Catch it. Oh. That thing's a pain in the ass. Well, Elon Musk wants to learn a move. Low kick. So low kick is... A powerful low kick makes the target fall over. The heavier the target, the greater the move's power. Let's get rid of detect. And give him low kick. Okay. Alright, I think that Mankey was so good. I think we want him in the party, don't we? And I think we're going to name him Quiet Man. Good God. So, yes. It lives in groups and treetops. If it loses sight of its group, it becomes infuriated by loneliness. Let's do it. Let's do it. No! All right. Since we already have... Now, we'll get rid of Elon Musk. That way we'll have a new fighting type. Here we go. Here we go. It's a female. Who cares? Who cares what it is? I don't care. We got 2022. No one cares about that shit anymore. I'm not going to waste a revive on him, sadly. We should have to find a Poké Center somewhere. All right. Um... So we got distracted for sure. Trying to catch all the Pokemon, right? What is that one? Oh, that's the ghost. We have those. Here's a trainer. Once I master the martial arts, what am I supposed to do afterward? There's another Pokemon over there. Esteban, the Black Belt. Esteban. Make you evolve at level 28. And then after that, you have to use a special move 20 times. Okay. Damn. So let's do Fury Swipes, Low Kick, or Seismic Toss. Let's do a Seismic Toss. Use Paint. Boosh! Now let's try Fury Swipes. Nice. Not bad. We only need to kill two Pokemon that have also seen Lucario. Finish him. Using Endure. He won't die now. He did it again, so he's never going to die if he keeps doing this, right? How many doors does he have? Not enough. Can use it this time. Here we go. All right. Full bond slide and custom Yoli leveling up here. Who wants to learn mimic? Uh, bond slide. All this does is it copies the user's move. I don't want that. I don't want that at all. Costume Yoli wants to learn play rough. I think that's good, if I remember correctly. Use your attacks by playing rough with the target. It may also lower the target's attack stat. That's good. So let's get rid of... Let's get rid of Baby Doll Eyes. Yes, let's get rid of Baby Doll Eyes. It gives play rough. There we go. There we go. You defeated Esteban. I never said I already mastered them. Well, there you go. Here's a new one. Got it from behind. I hit that ass right in the ass. Uh, so this is Mudbray.
defense row. Oh crap. Oh, the card off guard can't move. Good. I'll three swipe it. Oh, it does like no damage. Great. Oh no, every time you hit it, it goes up. Are you sh shitting me? How am I gonna inherit this thing? No! Oh god! You need Mimic to evolve Bonsly? Well, how was I supposed to know that? I don't know that. All right? I didn't know that. Man, I'm in trouble. I can't even get this thing. What do I do now? Let's try that. How was I supposed to know I needed Mimic? No one said anything. I didn't know that. I do no damage to this guy now. Oh my god. How am I ever gonna lower his health? No! My God! That's it. I'm using a great ball on this thing. It's paralyzed and it's lower health and a great ball. Come on, catch it! All right, we got it. That was a pain, right? That was a pain. You think you can relearn the move? How could I relearn the move? I don't know about that. So, I received a $3 tip. From Attorney Forever. It says, Hola, Phil. This is a weekend I spent hours in the area of the map where you are, and there's a lot of places to explore. Uh, sounds good. I'm having fun. I'm catching tons of Pokemon right now. I'm having a good time exploring. Thank you, Attorney Forever, for the $3 tip. $90 in tips. We're only $10 away from the, po uh, the Pikachu hat, guys. Remember, the sooner the better. That way, you know, the earlier we hit it, the longer you'll have the hat. So thank you for your support. <clears throat> All right, Mud Bray is ground tight. This Pokemon covers itself in mud that has regurgitated. The mud doesn't dry out even if it's exposed to the sun for a long time. Okay. So people are saying I can relearn the move. How would I do that? Mm hmm. I have no idea. Change moves? Remember a move. Mimic. Alright, get rid of fake tears. There you go. Now it knows Mimic. Right? There we go. So you can do this on the fly now. They totally changed it. Now you can learn any move on the fly. That's good, right? That's really good. Let's, let's heal. I don't want to waste a revive on Israel. Ah, screw it. I'll use it at 12. Here we go. All right. See here. Okay, so, how's Jasper today? He's energetic. He was running around the house earlier being very silly. He tried to sneak in here as well when I had the door open. He was trying to sneak into the office. All right, so, pretty cool area, although we might have gotten all the Pokemon from it already. Uh, I'm looking around. Wait, what's that? What is that? It's tiny. What is that? A flittle? What in the holy hell is a flittle? I don't know what this is. Let's beat it, beat it up. Use confusion. Oh, no! Ok, 
Okay. You like the jerseys that I own? I don't know. Like, I like the jerseys, too, but people seem to prefer the vest to the jersey. So, that's why I usually have the vest out with the Oh, uh, tackle it. Trying to catch it. Literally. Benny Joltian just did a super chat saying, great work, DSP. Keep it up. Thank you to Ben. Whoa, it immediately escaped, huh? Things of pain. I got to lower all the way to red. It's still not red. Let's try it now. Oh my god. Come on, it's red health. Catch it. Got it. Wow, that was hard, huh? That was seriously hard. Thank you to Benny Jol Joltian for the super chat. That was tough. All right. So it's a psychic type. Flittle's toes levitate about half an inch above the ground because of the psychic power emitted from the frills on the Pokemon's belly. Look at this thing. Is this new? A frills Pokemon? into the box for now. I jump for joy at catching it. It was so hard. Okay. Do a picnic? I don't think I have any food for a picnic, do I? I don't think I ever bought any. Oh, crap. I slid down. Oh, we got those guys. Yep, we already have those. What's that floating one? It's looking right at me. No! You got in the way. I wanted the floating one. I got this guy again. Covet? What does Covet do? Steals the target's held item. Let's try it. Jesus, why did it do so much damage? Oh my god. My Pokemon are getting destroyed. It's absolutely ridiculous. Oh. Okay, it's really neat. It needs to attack to rise, right? Nothing is effective. Why is this thing so powerful? It's the same level as my Pokemon, but it can insta-kill my Pokemon? What in the hell is going on here? I can't even hit it. Oh my god, I can't even hit it. Oh 
Oh my god. That was ridiculously overpowered. A regular dude. He's like super overpowered, man. I'm running out of healing items. I'm going to have to go buy more, by the way. Where was the, the floating Pokemon I was trying to catch? It disappeared. There it is. What is this thing? A mushroom? What is that? We got some weird stuff going on, man. A tad bulb? Tad bulb. Trip came in. I missed it. I'm sorry. Whoever tipped me five minutes ago, I missed it. I was uh, I absorbed into the game here. Very good. We got tab bowl mucus. That's really disgusting. I don't want it to mucus. So I received a $10 tip from CM Fool. He says they they there's a one chance you can find a dragon type in this zone. Oh really? So it's a random chance to find it in this area, huh? We have not seen a dragon type yet in the game, I don't think, right? Thank you very much, CM Fool, for the tip. And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we have hit our hat goal. It is time for the silly Pikachu hat for the rest of today's stream. So thank you guys for your support. Quick reminder, if you tip $25 or more, you can name a Pokemon permanently in the playthrough, and I'll try to use them for a bit. And if we had $150 of tips today, you could vote on a vest uh, for me to wear out of all of my different colored vests that are very silly. Complete the ensemble here. So thank you, CM Fool, for the tip. I appreciate that. Let's take a look at this thing. So it's electric type. Eel. No, Ella Tadpole Pokemon, it says. Tadpole shakes its tail to generate electricity. If it senses danger, it makes its head blink on and off to alert allies. Interesting. You know what I would call this one if it were me? I'd call it Edison. In honor of Thomas Edison. That's what I would call it. But that's me. It's up to you guys if you want to name it or not, okay? Now, let's keep looking around. Although, we may have finally exhausted all the Pokemon types in this area. As soon as I said that, I found a new one. Look. The moment I said it, there's a new one right in front of me. It's a turtle. Choodle. It's seismic tossing. Oh. Three swipes. Three fury swipes. Four fury swipes. Five fury swipes. Awesome. Short hold. I know, I love I love this hat. This is one of the most comfortable hats I have. It looks absolutely silly, but it actually is super comfy. Got him. Very good. Nicely done, Chootle. Caught. So, water type. Large front tooth is still growing in. When the tooth itches, the Pokemon bites another Chootle's horn, and the two Pokemon tussle. Wow. Why would a tooth itch exactly? I wasn't aware that a, a, a tooth has the ability to itch. Interesting. <laughs> Damn, we got a lot of Pokemon. I wonder how many Pokemon are in this game, because we've caught a ton so far, right? <clears throat> got him. That's the mud gray. Ooh, we got some fish. Okay, hold on. I want to catch the fish. There's another new one. Anything up here? No. Is he chasing me? I think he is. Let's 
It's got clouds for arms. Look at this thing. And swa blue. Swa blue, swa blue. Ooh, 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 swa blue. Effective, whatever it was, round. Swablu! I was using round. Ow! Oh. Oh, let's try to catch it. Derek says, Oh no, I didn't see your comment, Derek. What were you saying? I missed it. You catch the Swablu. Absolutely not. Insta catch! We got an insta catch. Very nice. Swablu! Ooh, ooh, ooh! Normal and flying tight. It constantly grooms its cotton like wings. It takes a shower to clean itself if it becomes dirty. Very nice. Yeah, I missed it. Sorry. Do you know, I like fighting Pokemon like Hitman Lee and Hitman Chan? They were cool. I mean, I haven't seen them in a long time, but they were pretty cool. <clears throat> the two variations. They were the ones that were punch and kick, right? One was a puncher, one was a kicker, I think. I gotta be running out of healing items. I'm gonna have to buy more. What? Why can't I ride him here? Well, it was a fish type that I wanted to catch. Oh, is it gone? The fish disappeared. Oh. There's a ton of fish in the river. Now they're all gone. Oh, look. This guy... Dude, there's so many Pokemon. I'm never going to get to do any of this story. I'm just going to be constantly fighting and catching all these raw Pokemon. There's a there's billion of them. Right? Jafloon. Wow. Isn't this a ghost? I think it's a ghost. All right. Coming back in the paw, paw, paw me. Focusing energy is not good. Super effective. He's gonna get paralyzed, right? No, he attacks anyway. Oh, this is not very effective. Okay. Nice. Now we'll try to catch it. A balloon ghost. What a weird Pokemon. A freaking balloon ghost, right? Get him. Nice. Got the balloon ghost. Yes. Boom. Triple level up. The quiet man wants to learn swagger. Moves like swagger. Let's see what swagger does. It enrages and confuses its target. However, they also sharply boost the target's attack stat. Nah, I don't think I want that. Nah. Don't want swagger. Moves like swagger. Flying and ghost type, Drifloon. It is whispered that any child who mistakes Drifloon for a balloon holds onto it and can wind up missing. That's disturbing. So basically, it's a ghost that kidnaps children and zip zips them off to the afterlife. Wow. Uh, can we name it Terrifying? That's what we should call it. Terrifying Child Abductor. That sounds like a Japanese horror movie or something, right? It seriously does. All right, let's head this way. Oh no, what I walk into? I walked into one. All right, let's beat this thing up quick. I didn't mean to walk into it. Derek, you remember that? He said, when he hears Swagger, he reminds me of Jack Swagger. Dude, Jack Swagger? He hasn't been called that in a million years, Derek. Come on, man. No one remembers that, Jack Swagger. Not even Jack Swagger remembers Jack Swagger. He knows himself as his new name in AEW. Could you say such a thing? <laughs> All right. Finish 
position. There we go. Do, 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 do. Nimble claw. Oh, nice! Bonsly is gonna evolve! Bonsly! Evolution! Suda will do! <laughs> Isn't it like Pseudo Wudo? I think it's supposed to be Pseudo Wudo, not Pseudo Wudo. It's Pseudo Wudo. Pseudo Wudo! Oh, oh. Rock. Although it always pretends to be a tree, its composition appears more similar to rock than vegetation. Pseudo Wudo! Pseudo. Oh, I wants to learn a new move. Slam. Let's teach it slam. Let's see. So the target is slammed with a long tail, vines, or the like to inflict the damage. 80 damage is pretty good. Um. Now we can get rid of Mimic. We don't need it anymore, right? Let's get rid of Mimic now. Very nice. Okay. Slam. Dun, dun, dun. Don't 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 let the suitable know we suitable know. So we got all of these now. Yes, we do. We caught all these Pokemon. Cool. Pseudo Wudo. There's a Magikarp splashing around, but we already got one. We're trying to turn into a Gyarados. So wait a minute. What's that down there? Is that where we started? What just happened? What is this map? Why did it do that? Where are we? We're here. What is this? A flying titan badge. Wait, what? Did the map rotate or something? It did. The map rotated. We want to go here. So we want to be going... Which way is north on this map? Here we go. We want to be going northwest. Northwest. We want to be going this way. Following the river. We need to a Titan Badge challenge. All right. There's a ghastly. Oh, ghastly, ghastly. Let's follow the, the road here, right? Oh yeah, Sherry's not remember there was a pseudo wudo that was gold in an episode. A golden pseudo wudo. Pseudo wudo, boobity boobity boom. Puppy feather. Pokemon are all chilling in the rain. You guys gotta get to uh, cover or something, right? Here we go. Let's do a Pokemon battle. Hey there. Standing in the rain like an idiot. Hey there, hey, I'm hitchhiking. Can I catch a ride on your Pokemon? What? No, you cannot ride on my legendary Pokemon, you asshole. You're not the protagonist. Backpacker Azure. His name is Azure. Alright. Fungul. There's a Fungul. I don't have a Fungul. Oh, it's a Fungus? Never mind, it's a Fungus. Let's do a double kick. Actually, that's a low kick. I did the wrong move. I thought it was double to get some open. That move sucks. Well, now it's all a waste of time. Look at this. What? Rashawn says there was a Fire Warrior Pokemon over there? Oh, I didn't know. Fungus. The Fungus Amoongus. Nice. Oh my god, the sun is coming out super bright right now. Outside. Let's do some Fury Swipes. The hippie trainer has shrooms? Exactly. He pulled out his bag of shrooms. Come on, finish it. Oh no, not the spore effect. No, I've been poisoned. Poisoned. Oh. Fungus does evolve into Amoongus. The Fungus Amoongus? It does. Wow, that's funny. Sorry, Fungus. I got him. 
Sorry I asked. <laughs> Sorry I asked, man. Now I'm poisoned. Okay. I have like no healing items left, do I? I guess you, you'll drink like lemonade and stuff though, right? So wait, where was this fire Pokemon you were talking about? Here I am. Where do you see a legendary? Oh, that's it? It says it's due south. Uh, it's, it says right here? It is not here. I'm standing on exactly where it says it is, and there is no... There is no legendary fire Pokemon here. Unless he's up there? Could he be up here, and I can't see him? Look around. Maybe I have to go up the, the cliff. Up and around here. but I am not seeing. It could be up on that ledge over there too, maybe, but it says behind me. I don't see him. Oh, Beast is the last Pokemon game you played was Colosseum? What was that for? It's weird because it's showing it like right here near me, but there's nothing here. was a long time ago, huh? Did it disappear? I think it's off of the map now. I think it disappeared. It did. It's gone. It's off the map now. So maybe it was a limited encounter thing and now it's gone. No, it still says it's there. I don't know, man. I don't see it. It's worth catching, but I should go back for it later. I just don't see it, man. What the hell? Oh, I don't see it. OPS, we hit the members goal yesterday. That is correct. Pokemon Center around the corner because I'm low on items and I'm also low on getting low on attacks, right? Oh, yeah, I totally think it's weird that my Pokemon doesn't use the wheels. I mean, it's supposed to be some kind of a vehicle and doesn't use the wheels. Kind of weird. Why does it have a wheel on its chest that doesn't use it? Let's put Israel back in the front spot. And let's head towards his poker center just to uh, rest up, right? How convenient to have this out in the middle of nowhere for me. Should buy some items along here too. Teal. Boom, 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 boom. I have a Ghastly. We already caught one. I don't need to catch one. Obi's is... I heard Ash finally turned 18. Strange news for him. It's good to finally make him an adult. I mean, he's been pretty ridiculously long, though. 
Uh, I definitely need to buy stuff from the Pokemart. Let's buy a good variety of things. You get a premier ball on the house when you buy a certain amount. I see. All right. Derek loves the chill Pokemon streams. You're welcome, Derek. I love playing the game. Press ZL and aim. You'll see if you already caught a Pokemon. Ah, yes. It has the Pokemon Pokeball next to it if you already caught it. Thank you for that little tip. That was from uh, El Grezura. What about this one? What is this? Oh, yeah, I got it. That's the Rock Ruff. Looks like I got all these. Here's a Pokemon trainer to fight. What did I walk into? I keep walking into guys I don't see. I didn't see this guy at all. Not very effective, not very effective, not very effective. into it. There's two different forms of Lycan Rock. What is a Lycan Rock? Play Rock. Nice. Oh, Lightning Ruff evolves from Rock Ruff. Oh, I see. I didn't know that. This this new Pokemon is fucking tops, man. This thing is tough. It kicks my butt. Roar. If I win. If I win, you gotta buy my CD. Oh, God. So it's like an aspiring indie musician or something. Maria the Musician. Oh, boy. Meow. Time to dig. That hurt. Good damage. Payday? Give me with money. Oh god, he almost killed me. Coins scattered everywhere. Take it out. There we go. Got him. Do I have a Pokemon from Gen 1 I love the most? The, the one that I always try to get in every game is Gyarados. I always try to get a Magikarp and evolve it into Gyarados. Every time, so. No one buys CDs anymore? Ha 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 That was actually a good line. What? No one buys CDs anymore? You idiot. All right. Oh no, I'm stuck. I'm stuck, I can't move. Okay. <laughs> Continue this way. This is where we're supposed to be going, up here, I think. Super potion, good, I need that. Yo, DSP. So from what I gather, it seems like Open Sky Titan lives somewhere up on the mountain. But there are all crazy boulders raining down from the mountain, too. It's going to be a little tricky to stand around and look for the Titan while you're dodging all of those. Oh, I think you'll be sent flying if you get hit by a falling boulder. But maybe you could power your way up atop that brood of yours. Oh. 
Oh. Darth Gullbox says he loved Charizard as a kid. Derek says T Rocket is still around and they're still trying to catch Pikachu. Jesus. Well, I guess it's just something for persistence. Whoa. What the hell is that? There's an item down there. I have no idea what it is. Look. What happens if I go down there? Am I going to get screwed? Or should I jump down there and see what it is? Uh. Ha! There's an ominous black stake driven into the ground. Will you pull it out? Sure. When you pulled out the stake, it crumbled and vanished. What? Oh. Uh... Oh, hello. One of the coin guys. So, what was that stake? <laughs> I don't know what I just did. I have no idea what I just did. Uh, a protein drink. Iron. Potion. I don't know. I guess we're going in this cave. Huh. Well, now we're stuck down here, right? Because I went all the way down like an idiot. Go up here now. We already have all these Pokemon. This is one of the raids, right? Right there. Is this something you do later? I don't want to spoil. Oh, okay. So, but I needed to do it. So I didn't waste my time doing that. That was fine, right? Like, I need to maybe do all the stakes later. As long as it's not a waste of time, then it's cool. Well, by the way, guys, it is almost time for our break of the stream. Thank you all for being a great audience. Thanks to everyone who supported the stream in any way. If uh, you would still like to support the stream, a great way you can do that is by liking the stream and try to get it to 100 likes. That's something that I, I, you know, I enjoy doing every stream is getting 100 likes. It helps for engagement. And, of course, any other support is greatly appreciated, but you guys have been a great supportive audience so far today. So, you know, no complaints for me. It's been a good, a good one, a good interactive, <clears throat> fun stream for me. What the hell? What the hell are those? These things are Pokemon? A Flubebe! It's the Flubebe! We need a Flubebe! To trade it. Flubebe. Oh, the Flubebe. Say hello to the Flubebe. Bye 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 Come on, baby, get that flabay bye. Great doggy. Let's catch the flabay bay. It's a great ball. It's not a good ball. It's a great ball. Come on, great balls of flabay bay. Flabay bay. We got the flabay bay. Very nice. Flabay bay. Nicely done. We caught the flabay bay. Let's see what it is. What is a flabay bay? Fairy type, it's an orange flower. This flabebe rides an orange flower. On its head, it wears a crown of pollen that has some healing properties. Interesting. What are my favorite type of chips? Flabebe chips. They're delicious. They're absolutely delicious. There you go. <laughs> no. All right. So, basically, a chip that I just tried recently that I never had before, Pop Corners. What it's supposed to be is it's, it's, it's made of, like, you know, the same thing popcorn would be, but it's actually a chip rather than a piece of popcorn. And infamously, I have problems with popcorn because I always get popcorn stuck in my teeth. So I, this was actually really good. I tried it. I was like, wow, that's delicious. Why is this thing so small? Wait a minute. Selling it? I don't remember selling it being this small at all. I remember selling it being pretty big. Why is this sound so tiny? Oh. It's level 20. Oh, shit. It's level 20. So we gotta get out of it. We gotta get a powerful Pokemon in here. This thing is a badass Pokemon. What's good against electricity? Rock? I think Rock type, correct? 
I think so. Let's try it. I think rock type is good. This time, Pokemon have more accurate sizes. So because the Salamander, it's supposed to be really small. Go Night Eye. That's rock type. Even though you look like wood, you're not. It's Pseudo Wudo. I fooled you with my Pseudo Wudo. All right, let's do this. Let's get it. Oh, yeah. Oh, hi -oh, hi -oh. let's catch this guy. That was giant damage. Catch the Salandip with a great ball. Salandip, Salandip, you caught it. It's Salandip, and you got it. Yeah. Doesn't that thing turn into a, a flaming salamander later? I'm pretty sure it does, right? Has flames all over its body. Nice level up. Looks like Baxter's going to learn a new move. Low sweep. Hmm. It, I mean, low sweep is only good against very high weight Pokemon. So. Uh, no, it doesn't. It's different. It makes a swift attack on a target's legs, which lowers the speed stat. I'm going to get rid of work up. I'm going to get rid of work up and teach it low sweep. There you go. It's, I guess low kick and low sweep are different. They sound the same, but they're different. Okay. Nice. That worked out really well. Salandip, poison and fire. It taunts prey and lures them into a narrow rocky area where it will then spray it with toxic gas out of its butthole to make it dizzy and take them down. There you go. No name yet, but maybe someone would like to name Salandip. That's a pretty powerful Pokemon, I feel. Poison and fire is a good combination, right? Now Israel is burned. Oh, wait. I didn't want to do this. I wanted to go to the box. Poor Israel is, has been burned. This is not good. The stinky gas Pokemon. Oh, Israel's evolving. Here we go. We're going to finally see Palmy turn into a second form. What will it be? Here we go. Oh, my God. It's even cuter. <laughs> Palmo. Why is it so cute? It's electric, and now it's fighting type. It has a dual type now. When its group is attacked, Palmo is the first to leave into battle, defeating enemies with a fighting technique that utilizes electric shock. All right. Israel wants to learn arm thrust. Let's see. So the user attacks with open arm thrust. It hits two to five times. It's a multi-hit, a multi-hit move. Okay, let's get rid. Let's get rid of Thundershock. Yeah, let's get rid of Thundershock. Here we go. To evolve Palmo, you need to do a thousand steps in Let's Go and level up once. What in the holy hell is Let's Go? I don't know what that means. I don't know what that means. What's Let's Go? First thing, we got to cure its, its burn. Do we have a burn heal? Yes, we have one. Oh, God. Only one. All right. Oh, let it walk with you like this. So it has to take a thousand steps like this, and then it can evolve. Okay. Is this a new enemy? It is. the evolved form of the weasel it is gum shoes oh man what is it will be good against this guy i can't tell what was what shit it's the evolved form of that that thing from earlier but i can't remember what it is is it fighting type is it ground type i can't remember what it is crap without I, without remembering i'm not gonna be able to beat this thing all right, let's do nuzzle and try to uh, try to at least paralyze it at first. Here, defense fell. That's not good. Use fighting. All right, we're gonna try fighting. Arm thrust. Oh, slappy slappy, slappy slappy. Two times. It's tough. 
It's paralyzed. Good. Ready? Here you go. Slappy slappy. It's like sumo slap. Sumo pushes. <laughs> it's great. Derek, yes, I see your I see your comment now. What's wrong? We gotta try to catch this thing now. Gum shoes. Catch the gum shoes. Come on, please catch it. Please catch it. Please catch it. Yes! Gum shoes! Nice. Not wow, we got tons of experience. Damn. I want to let you know about selling this evolution. Oh, okay. I didn't see it. I'm sorry, man. Once it finds signs of prey, we'll patiently stake out the location, waiting until the sun goes down. All right. Let's put him in the box. Hui, 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 hui. All right. Let us save. And we're going to take our break. Okay. Okay.